City Council reviewing that proposed budget right now, which includes plans to build the city's largest homeless shelter. Our Zara Barker joins us inside City Hall with all the details. Zara. Kathleen and Andrew, right now, city council members here on the 12th floor of City Hall are currently deliberating and kind of debating this $5.8 billion budget that has sparked a lot of controversy. In just the last five minutes, we just got done with about two hours of public comment, about half of them in person, the other half virtually. I want you to take a look inside. It is pretty much a packed room toward the front of the building or inside of those council chambers. Not as packed, though truthfully as we were expecting it with this big budget that has drawn a lot of controversy. On the table in front of San Diego City Council members is the city's $5.8 billion budget. There are no easy choices in this difficult budget year. And I know that these modifications reflect the majority of the priorities expressed by the public and my colleagues. But after an independent budget review, Council Member Kent Lee says there's more money to work with than what they had planned for. Outlined in our final budget proposal are changes intended to help preserve as well as supplement programs that are proven to work, programs that hundreds of thousands are relying on at this very moment, programs that help to support shelter, and programs that people would immediately feel the impacts from if funding were to be reduced or stopped. The mayor and city council members have been aligned in prioritizing funding for public safety, flood prevention, and the homeless. In the budget is $26 million toward the homeless crisis with a controversial plan to turn this empty building in Little Italy into a 1,000-bed homeless shelter and to turn the former H. Barracks site near Liberty Station into 200 safe sleeping parking sites, which is allotted for $2.5 million in the budget. When asked if Lee supports the budget, money for the Little Italy shelter. Here's what he said. The money that is available for new shelter identification for the possibility of tenant improvements for new shelter, that, that remains. Uh, you know, I think as a council, um, we agree with the mayor that there is a need for new shelter within the city. Now it's realistic th to think that city council members along with this presentation from the independent budget group could be going on for a few more hours. So we could be just a couple of hours until we get a final decision to see if this $5.8 billion budget will be approved as is. Of course, we'll continue to be here until this is approved and we'll bring you the latest right here on Fox 5. Reporting live inside City Hall, Zara Barker, Fox 5 News. Always a lot riding on those city budgets. Thank you so much, Zara.